Hello friends, today we are going to talk about transferring users from one application to another that may or may not be on the same domain or the same server or using the same app pool. However, they use the same database for authentication. So for this example, we have a shared table in a shared database called web user which has a user ID which is to uniquely identify the user a username, a password, a token, and a token expiration. Uh, the token and token expiration will be used to authenticate user when transferring across multiple sites without requiring them to re-log in. Um, in this example we have a login.aspx page which takes the username and the password, makes a web request to the transfer user handler, and the transfer user handler returns a valid token for the next five seconds if it works. If it doesn't work it doesn't return anything and the login page already has the logic to not redirect if it doesn't get the token. Uh, upon redirect the welcome page simply has a message that says welcome username. Um, it checks to make sure the tokens a valid token and that the token has not expired. So we'll check real quick on how this whole thing comes together when I go to the login page see what the URL is the port is 858 I'm gonna log in and it should transfer me to a completely different website which is 861 now the token will be valid for five seconds so if I hit refresh it should give me an error saying that the token is invalid or access is denied. So we'll give that a shot and it is working as expected. Uh, hope this helps. Please let me know if you have any questions and thank you again for your time.